Hello everyone and welcome to my reaction to Jujutsu Kaisen chapter 163. If I sound at all kind of tired and drowsy during this video, it's because I am. I just got out of bed like five minutes ago to record this video, so, uh, yeah. Uh, before we get into this reaction, quick little announcement. Uh, if you didn't watch the Kengen review from Wednesday, I've lowered the subscriber goal for 2021 down to 4,000 because, well, frankly... Unless the subscriber gain rate increases like tenfold in the next week, we're not going to hit 5,000. Whereas 4,000 seems much more reachable based on the current sub game. So, yeah, if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, you should definitely hit that subscribe button. Because I'm pretty sure if everyone watching this video who wasn't subscribed, you know, changed that, we would reach our goal in no time. Uh, so, yeah, with that out of the way... Let's go with this reaction. Uh, let, let's see what we have going on here. Uh, what? Ah, no. No, you're doing it completely wrong. Do it like this. This. Wait, what's up? What are you keeping quiet for? You just have to plaster a smile on. Ah, see, I told you so. Not that I actually said anything. How do you not understand? Are you an idiot? What, what, what the fuck is going on here? In a certain place one day... The man speaks of what a victim should do, but his philosophy has no way of reaching. So, uh, what, what is this? Amai is like, um... He doesn't seem... Is he the, one of the bullies in this situation beating up this kid, or...? Well, well, let's find out. These guys don't have much going in academics or even sports, but they have a whole lot of pride. One man mingling with beasts. I see. So, yeah, oh my, oh my, the liar. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, he looks like such a smug shit here. Good lord. Um, so what? He just tags along with people who have more power and influence than him so that he can get an easy ride? In order to avoid damaging their pride, you just gotta laugh and go along with whatever they say. That way, the other groups won't target you as well. And sometimes you can reap the rewards for yourself as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Knock it off. Another idiot. Is that a school jacket from West Junior High? It's some middle school brat. He's not even being polite with us. It's Yuji. I'm going to teach you a lesson. And Yuji rocks that guy's shit. Say no to violence. Uh, and then, uh, Yuji just kind of starts kicking these guys' asses. As he should. Good job, Yuji. These guys... I mean, just look at these disgusting, like, plaid pants they wear. Fucking God. They deserve it. What about you? Mm, me? Cullen Game Players, Itadori Yuji, Amai Rin. So now we have Megumi here with Remy. Hey, what? If you're planning on passing through Ikebukuro to get to Shinjuku, forget it. That area has an abundance of resources. There's a higher likelihood that we'll run into other players. There's two reasons we're using this route. It's easier to find our way here, and my base is nearby. Ooh, but I don't know. Ooh, see, Remy... This is a really good, um, you know, sort of mystery, I guess, that Gege is set up. Because Remy is so goddamn obvious, and she says things like every other time she speaks that leads you to believe that she is actively trying to lure Megumi into some kind of trap, or she's trying to screw him over in some way. Whereas Amai just seems like so not obvious that it's obvious. Um, and then especially the stuff at the start of this chapter, he seems like someone that would be working with another guy to fuck people over for his own good. Let's find out. At least let me take a shower. I've hardly gotten any rest since yesterday. Oh my god, you poor thing. Higuruma has made this base, this theater, his base of operations. Would he? Provided he hasn't already moved. Oh. The Tokyo Metropolitan Theater is only 15 minutes walk from Kanameko Station. Fascinating. You've been really helpful, thank you. Hey, hey, wait up. I would like to meet up with my friend first, so I'm in a hurry. I've never met Higuruma, but even Haba had his ass handed to him one time. Wait, so Haba... 
Cobb is a fucking jobber. He, he's a loser. He's trash tier, am I? I don't care if he was beaten by Higuruma. Higuruma is one of the strongest members of the Cullen game. That's not saying much. Um, but good part on Yuji to be like, why would I go try and confront Higuruma by myself? He's one of the strongest players in the game. I need to go get Megami. The idea was we were both going to go find Higuruma. So good on him. I'll be fine then. I also defeated Helihead, so I should be able to get away if I have to. Ugh, good point. Yeah, I don't believe Higuruma would have... Why would Higuruma have let Haba live? Haba is someone that was like, yeah, I'll go around killing people just for points. I don't think Higuruma is killing people for points. I just don't get that impression. Well, see ya. Say it. I need to say it. I should put an end to this. I'm sorry, Itadori. Yeah, he's the liar. Higuruma? Ah, unfortunately, my name's... Reggie. Oh! God damn! <sighs> what the fuck is he wearing, by the way? Is he wearing the receipts? You were duped. So... These, this is like 500 IQ plays on Gege's part. You make Remy super obvious, like super obviously trying to betray Megumi. So that it seems like Amai is actually the really obvious one because he's not super sussy. So then Remy actually is the person lying and you're like, oh my god, I can't believe it. I thought it was Amai. I mean, just look at my reactions from this chapter. Is he wearing the goddamn receipts? Why are you making that face? You don't scare me. Just to let you know, Reggie is superior- is super strength. Shut up. Oh, what a waste of time. Oh, Higuruma is in the theater. Why is he in a bathtub? A bathtub? Who are you and what are you doing here? I could ask you the same. Have you ever taken a bath with your clothes on? Nope, that's a really weird thing to do, Higuruma. You kinda are on some Joker shit. Feels better than you'd think. Really? Well, I don't plan on testing it out anytime soon, so... Oh, that's right. Back in elementary school, I loved the clothes swimming lessons. I get that. I've recently stopped caring about a lot of things, so I'm challenging myself trying to... Trying some new things I believed were wrong. Like killing people? I'm well into my mid-thirties, yet I've become something of a delinquent. You gonna laugh? Well, it's kind of funny. You must be Higuruma. Indeed. I want to talk. Wait, wait, wait. You'll need to pay a consulting fee of 5,000 5, yen for every 30 minutes. Huh? Just kidding. I wanted to be a pretend asshole lawyer. <laughs> oh, Higuruma, you're great. Oh, I love this guy. He's absolutely wonderful. I see. Since earlier, he's... You've got 100 points, right? He's not a past incarnated sorcerer. He's a modern sorcerer that's awake in a curse technique. He'll hear me out. There's room for some negotiation. This is where Megumi's mistake is going to come into play. Yuji is going to think Higuruma is way more reasonable than he is. Uh, frankly, we want to end the culling game. Ah, hang on. Time out. I mean, we want to nullify the requirement to kill each other rather than end the game. In order to do that, we want to add a rule using your 100 points. Let me also be frank with you as well. I refuse. Is that also a joke? No? It's just I can sense some possibility from within the culling game. Laws are powerless at times, but what about the rules of the culling game? Since the jujutsu power that has been granted to me is real, the rules must be real as well. There's no need for accusations or prosecutions. Without arguing over the truth, what if those who break the rules are punished as absurdly as the laws of physics? It's a wonderful thing. I admire, I admit that there are flaws within the rules. However, I want to watch over the barrier system which serves as the foundation of the game. I can't have the game ending right away. So Higuruma, after seeing how flawed and fucked up the Japanese legal system is, he wants to see how the Cullen game runs as a system of rules. Well, that's certainly something. I guess after seeing things are so fucked with the system he was already a part of, he wants to see if this one actually kind of works. Of course, this one works 
for completely different reasons, I guess he just wants to see if it's a functioning system. Especially rules 2 and 8, I want to witness the curse technique removal in action. I mean, me too, I guess. I want to see what exactly that's supposed to look like. Rules-wise, I think you'll die if your technique is taken away. The culling game itself is a ritual. Everyone in this country will die while you drag your feet. You're lying. The culling game wants to run on forever. Even I'm not sure about that. Well, Higuruma, how do you know that? The culling game... How do you know what it's for? Let me change my wording. You will let us use your 100 points, Higuruma. Have you ever killed someone who's pissed you off? It feels better than you'd think. A death match begins with points at stake. Jujutsu Kaisen is on break next week, which I already know about. Well, I guess that means I can sleep in next Friday. Um, I'm probably going to be doing a video talking about the strongest curses or whatever. Not, not like a top 10 thing, I'm just going to be talking about uh, the notable curses in the series for the most part. Uh, but yeah... That's all for this week's reaction. Good chapter. Actually, really good chapter, I think. Way better than the last two weeks. Not that the last two weeks had bad chapters. I just think this one was a lot more interesting, to be quite frank. Um, but, uh, yeah. That's all. Uh, the review will hopefully be out sometime later today. I know I am going to be busy starting in, like, the early afternoon. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll I'll get the review done really early and then have it out. Maybe by the afternoon. I don't want to make any promises. We'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. So yeah, with that, that's all I have to say for this week's reaction. If you enjoyed, please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. I do YouTube Kaisen chapter reactions and reviews every week that we get a new chapter. Whenever we're on break, I find something else to do. Uh, if you enjoy discussing Jujutsu Kaisen with other people, or you just enjoy the content I produce on this channel, I highly suggest you check out my Discord server. I have a link to that down in the description. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys around. Take care.